I'm just gonna finish my coffee right quick. I don't want it to get cold before <laughs> by the time I go through all this, it's gonna be totally cold. You guys know what I mean, right? Welcome back friends to my channel. Today I have a fall decor haul for you guys. I uh, went to at home, Hobby Lobby mainly, a couple things from TJ Maxx, Bath and Body Works, and I also have one item I ordered from Amazon. So today it's been raining and thunderstorms outside. I thought it was the perfect day to just sit down on the floor, some comfortable clothes, go over some fall decor with you guys that I've purchased from the store just so far. And we're gonna get into that video. I have fixed me a pumpkin everything mug of coffee. I don't have any sponsors, you guys, but if you have, if you love coffee as much as I do and you love syrups, I always enjoy these Amaretti syrups. I put two pumps of pumpkin pie syrup, of this syrup, and then one of the toasted marshmallow with a little bit of Splenda and some whip and it's absolutely amazing. So I'm just trying to get into the fall vibe so we can go through our haul together. All right, so if you guys are interested in what I picked up from the store, my name is Christy. If you're new, I wanna welcome you here to my channel. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Let's get into the haul. All right, the first place we're gonna go through is Hobby Lobby because it's probably where I got the most, okay? So the first thing that I purchased was this raffia, like this was $5.99. And of course, all their fall right now is 40% off. So all of this was 40% off, okay? This is like a raffia. I picked up two packs of it. You can put it in baskets and things like that. I use this a lot. I've used it in fall Christmas trees, baskets, centerpieces. It's really handy, okay? All right. The next thing that I grabbed was a couple of these pumpkin stems, okay? There is, these were $6.99, so $6.99. This one is like a beige, and this one is actually, you can tell I've been playing with it already. This is a white, so I have a beige. This is more of a white, and then I grabbed another. I have a few oranges already but I grabbed an orange. And make sure, you guys, make sure you look at your stems because this one's missing a, it's missing a stem on the top, okay? So make sure you look at those and make sure they're not. Also too, sometimes you'll see the glue where they've put the stem on and you'll see this glue gooked around. Make sure you don't get that, okay? All right, so I got one of each color of those. And then I picked up, also have these, but I, I grabbed two more. These were $2.99, 40% off. This is a very familiar stem. If you're going with all neutral, you have to play with them. You can see they're kind of stuck together because they're new, but if you're doing a neutral theme and you don't do a lot of orange and you're just going with white and kind of like these textures back here, this is a beautiful stem for that. You can put it with some like grapevine wreath pumpkins. I also have some of those. So 40% off on those. So I picked up two. Then I purchased this stem, which I don't know if it's new or not. I have not seen this stem before, but it's a multicolored leaf. Let's see how much this. $2.99. Okay. So $2.99 Hobby Lobby. I grabbed three of them because I figured that would be, I'm gonna start with three. Look how pretty that golden green is. That's just absolutely stunning. I like that. So we're gonna start with three. It has a gold with uh, amber kind of orange mixed in. And you can use these with your other florals. So I got three of those. Next, I purchased 
a couple of tear trays. They're similar, but they're two different sizes, okay? So this first one has these black knobs on the bottom. Now these tear trays are with the fall items. They're not with the farmhouse stuff or in the middle of the store. They're actually with the fall. So they were 40% off as well, okay? The big one was $7.99. Of course, 40% off on everything. And it's actually a good size. And then I also grabbed the smaller one, same thing. Perfect size for a little pumpkin, right? So these two sizes. And the smaller one is $4.99. Okay. And also another thing, when you guys are picking up tier trays, any kind of support or tier tray, make sure you lay it on a flat surface, either find a shelf or the floor, whatever, and make sure it doesn't wobble because that's a hardware issue. Just a tip. I've bought a couple before and it doesn't want to lay and then you, you don't want that. So just test it in the store so you don't have to take it back. Okay. So I got two of these. All right, and then I saw these. I don't know if they had these last year. I usually do a Christmas tree or a fall tree, and I saw these. They may have had them. I know everyone went notes last year. They're, they're a velvet texture. There's a cream, and then like this burnt orange. Really beautiful, absolutely stunning, that I thought would look good on a fall tree that I plan on doing this year. So I know they had Christmas last year. You could find the green and the red at Michael's and other places. And even the cashier that rang these up said they didn't know that they had these. So they were $10.99 and then 40% off of that. So I purchased three. I figured that's nine of each color, nine balls for each color. So, those are really beautiful. So I'm excited about using those. Next, I grabbed this ribbon set. It's a velvet ribbon set. This is from the ribbon section. It's not in the fall. It's, you have to go over where the ribbon is. I know this particular set was so popular at Christmas. Everyone that was doing the neutral Christmas with the velvet balls and the, the beautiful color with the browns, you could not find this. So and I may use this again for Christmas as well, but definitely fall colors. And I might use those to hang my ornaments with. I'll just have to see how that goes. All right, $8.99 for this set. And then in the fall section, I purchased a couple. You guys know I have a small table. We have refinished the top. It's a beautiful wood color. So I saw these, these are by Robert Stanley. They're a, a lace, let me see if I can get close enough. It's like a cream colored lace placemat. It's really pretty. I picked up two of these. And then you could put, like I have a brown charger with some acorns on it. You could put that on top and it would really pop. I also have orange ones. You could, you know, it would make for a really pretty fall place setting on your table. So, we got two of those. This was, the placemats were $6.49. 40% off. Okay. The last two items aren't fall, but my husband and I did find these while we were there, and I didn't even know. I am, I do drive a Jeep Wrangler. I had an infinity before we moved up here to the mountains and I have a Jeep Wrangler and they have Jeep items at Hobby Lobby. So absolutely fall. I don't know how many sweaters I own that's gonna match this toboggan, but look how adorable. It's a Jeep toboggan, okay? It was in the center of the store. It was $11.99. It was not on sale, but it was worth it. I love the color. It's very rustic. It's gonna look really good with, like I said, some hoodies or sweater, and it's super comfortable. And then I also grabbed a decorated four x four emblem for badge for the side of my Jeep. I thought that was 
really nice as well. And they weren't that expensive. $4.49. Not on sale. So, got those for my Jeep. Okay, next I'm going to show you the two items I purchased from at home. Now, my goal with this haul was just to focus on fall. When I went in at home, I did not see a whole lot of fall yet. I saw a lot of Halloween items, a lot of, of things in that category, but I was there specifically that day for fall. So, I only picked up two set of stems. The first one is this wood. They're like wood stems. Trying to get them really, there you go, close enough. They're like a wood texture. These were $3.99. This is inside, you can't really see it, but $3.99. They were not on sale. And I also grabbed a lighter one like this. I love to use these stems in floral arrangements, centerpieces in the fall. I have also used the little curly cues. I love to use these stems outside of put them, stick them in a Christmas tree uh, that's fall decorated and put some raffia in there so it looks like hay and just wood coming out. So these are absolutely stunning to use for that kind of vibe, okay? All right, so I picked up these two. One more thing, going back to Hobby Lobby for a minute. I didn't purchase this from Hobby Lobby, but they have these, which is why I grabbed this one. I have been going through my bins the last few days. It's a lot to go through, but I'm really having fun with it because fall's my favorite. They have these crystal, I'm sure most people have these, but this one is a crystal pumpkin. I saw these at Hobby Lobby when I went to purchase these items and I actually walked around the store with it and then I was like, I've got one of those, I believe. I'm gonna use this one. You can use it for candy. You can use it for, I think this one came, I used it for a coffee bar with some coffee pods and things like that. You can use it for candy, trick or treat, whatever. I'm gonna use mine this year as a bath salt holder. So I just wanna put my bath salts, I wanna change up my drawer in my bathroom with something elegant. I like to keep my bathroom really elegant. So I'm gonna put this pumpkin in there and then I'm gonna do my little spoon, unless I find a have the little pumpkin spoons, but that's not enough. I need a lot of bath salts, right? So I'm gonna put that in there and this is gonna be in my bathroom with my bath salts. So I'm gonna kind of change that up for the next season. All right, with that being said, I only picked up two things from TJ Maxx. Again, no, no fall that I saw of. I didn't even see any fall candles at TJ Maxx yet. I saw some Halloween and some aisles of that. They were just starting to put that out on the shelves, but my focus in this haul was fall, of course. So I grabbed these two items though in the beauty section. The first one is, now that we're talking about bath salts, is this Dr. Teal's. This is a cozy cashmere. I can smell it through the bag. It actually smells really, really good. These salts were only $3.99 at TJ Maxx. So for this big bag. So, cozy cashmere. So, I can't wait to load my pumpkin up with that. It smells amazing. And then I grabbed this bath sponge that I thought I would mix in there with some salts, some soaps, some natural soaps, and um, make that a cute display uh, near my bath tray. All right. So, the next thing was Home Goods and Marshalls. And they didn't have a whole lot of fall yet, but I saw these two items that I really liked. This is a fragrance. It's called Charred Oak. Anything wood for fall, you guys, bonfire, oak, anything that smells like that. I wish we had smell of vision but we don't. It just smells amazing. So, it's got this elegant type wood burning kind of not overly strong it's really light but it's just enough i can use this i can spray this on my pumpkins on my pillows all of this and it will carry that scent through the house so this charred oak it was only 5.99 at marshall's so i'm excited about that and then these were 7.99 they were some mugs that i saw being a coffee lover especially this time of year, and I can also use them through Christmas for cocoa and teas and things like that, or these beautiful glasses. They're a pretty good size. They're a set of four. 
They have kind of a squared off handle, so they're really pretty. And then Bath & Body Works, they did not have, they did have some fall scents out. The wallflowers, I just got the pumpkin pecan waffles. This one is really strong, I feel like. So if you guys, you know, don't like really strong baking scents, then you might wanna go with something a little more lighter. And then I got a leaves. Leaves is my favorite scent by Bath & Body Works. I think I've said that on my candle video before. I grabbed four sanitizers. I actually grabbed six. They were six for 10, but I gave two to my daughter because we were shopping together. The first one is coffee and whiskey. Love it. And I have holders for this type of sanitizer, so I just went with that. Coffee and whiskey. This one is leaves. This one is uh, afternoon apple picking. Well, that screams fall, right? And then this one is crisp morning air. So I feel like that's a pretty good variety for fall, different scents. And then I had a free travel coupon with them. So I just got this Gingham Glow. Uh, it was worth $9.95 and I got it for free. This one reminds me so much of like a dandelion or sunflower is what it really smells like. It's a really good clean smell, but it's a very kind of overpowering flower smell, but it's called Gingham Glow, okay? I think that's one of their new scents. I have one more item that I purchased from Amazon and I saw it advertised and I was like, oh, I must have that. And this, this is as if fall, this is really more like Halloween, but I couldn't resist. This jack-o'-lantern cank pan, this is by Wilton. It is adorable, so it's got the holes like on one side. So this jack-o'-lantern pan, this was only $7. Maybe, I think it was like $7.98 when I purchased it. All right, I think that is the end of our haul, guys. I've gone over everything that I've purchased so far. I am going to continue to go in the stores and look for new items. So I'll be posting um, more haul videos, more footage from things that I find and that kind of thing on the shorts and Instagram. If you haven't subscribed already, I would really appreciate you doing so as I'm a new growing channel. I'm very excited about this new upcoming season. I hope all of you are enjoying your summer. I'm going to go ahead and get back into my bins and do some organizing. I appreciate you watching. I hope all of you are staying safe and I'll see you on the next video. It's so good, guys. It's so good. Make you one. It's Nobody knows it's 90 degrees outside. Just us. It's fine. Yep. Make you one. It's okay. It's 68 degrees in here. Nobody knows. It's all right. You can wear pumpkin slippers in July. I won't judge. I won't. Yep. Really good. All right, seriously, we're getting into this haul.